at it. And now, here's the rule. Okay? So, when you, don't set it down yet. Okay? So, when you set it down, he's on it. If I'm circling, he can't go. If I come towards him at all, no matter how far away I am, he can come bite me. Right? If he comes and bites me, I'm going to fight him to let him know he did the right thing. I'm going to freeze. I'm going to count to two. I'm going to look at you, and I'm going to go like this, and I should start to pull back. But as soon as I pull back, you're going to pop him with the leaf. Do not say anything. Just pop him with the pinch collar. When he lets go, tell him, object, or whatever you say for him to get on it. So if it's whatever your command is, object, he gets on it. When he gets back on it, with his front feet, you're going to grab his harness, say yes, I'm going to come back and give him a bite. So the only words that you're allowed to use are object and yes. And you're not allowed to speak to him at all if he's biting me, right? So don't give him a command to out. Don't say object if he's still biting me. You can speak to him once he lets go of me. What we want for the dog to figure out is that my pulling away is his trigger to let go. Okay? So because he knows a command, if I start to pull away and you say the command, then he just waits to listen to the command. We want him to think it's that. So now I pull, and as soon as I pull, pop, he gets popped. And then when he lets go, you say object. And then pretty soon I'll pull, he'll pop off on his own. So You'll say object. Like second when you pull, I mean, do I pop No, as soon as I do, I'm going to go, I'm going to fight him. I'm going to stop moving. I'm going to go 1,001, 1,002. And I'm going to do that with my head. Okay. And right when I do that, that means I'm pulling back, and you're going to go pop. And he's going to let go, and you're going to say object, and he's going to run back. You grab his harness, give him a reward. Now, okay, so now, if I come forward, and I get up to a certain point, about a meter, and he hasn't come to bite me, I'm going to back up, back away and stimulate him, right? So if I'm backing away, you can't let him go, right? So if I'm coming forward, he can go. If I'm backing away, you got to block him from going. So if he tries to follow, you just block him with the leash and tell him object, and he has to stay on the object because we're going to make frustration. So if he chooses to wait for me to make a motion, then I'm going to frustrate him and do it again. Frustrate him and do it again until he finally can't take it. And I'm coming in, and he's going to go boom and bite me. Okay? Does someone understand all that? <laughs>